Hello everyone, this is the most magnificent bird, Buckbeak, speaking to you today. And in today's video, I'm going to be trying out a new team, well, sort of a new team. And I remember in my last Conquest video, I mentioned that I was going to make a new team that I didn't have all the pieces to that team. Well, I now have all the pieces to that team and I'm going to show you what that team is. So the current battle pass is going on right now and as you can see I have the current avatar crossing blades with Ezekiel it's a pretty good pretty nice avatar and you guys know my feelings on the um, battle passes this time I gotta say I broke my one rule and I actually bought this particular battle pass does this mean I'm going to start buying battle passes again? No, probably not. I made this exception for this particular weapon. And right here, as you can see, uh, yeah, right here, I have Emperor Ezekiel at Limit Break 3. I just broke down... I don't know if broke down is the right word, but I went on and spent the 35 on him, got all five copies, because I'm already missing out on thousands of the Javelin hits. There's no way I would have been able to get him free to play, and I have the Katana. So, you know, Ezekiel gives out 6,000 trauma when you start a battle, but this weapon also gives out 4,000 trauma when you hit an enemy. So this is kind of the same team I use, but there's two different tunes in here. Emperor, Ezekiel, and Wanderer. Now, you might be wondering, why do I have Wanderer in here? Well, for those that don't know, he does have camouflage in his kit, but in his signature move, he gives out 10,000 trauma for two turns. And I figured I would do a couple of friendly duels and a couple of raids and I'm gonna test it out and see how it works out so first I think I'm gonna do a couple of friendly duels and I forgot to ask you guys I hope you guys are doing well and I hope all of you are staying safe out there oh no not these annoying pop-ups come on now yeah I'm doing good and how are all of you doing I hope all of you are doing good and staying safe out there. And I don't think we should waste any more time. I think we should go ahead and jump into it, shall we? So let's see if we can do anything here uh, with this team. Not that team. Hold on, where is it at? Right, this team right here with Wanderer. Now, this is going to be kind of tricky. Not going to lie, but we're going to see how this works out. Let's go. So, who has the trauma? Nor and Eugene? So, if we ta attack with Ezekiel, he now has almost 21,000 trauma. Let's add 10,000. That'll probably take him out. Yeah, that's going to take care of him. So we're going to see the main star, the main stars of this video is going to be Emperor, Ezekiel, Wanderer. Well, Ezekiel is stunned right now and Wanderer is down at the moment. 
Oh boy. <laughs> Not a great first start, but we got a couple more. Yeah, okay. I was kind of nervous. Uh, not nervous, but I wasn't too confident about going up against that team. That's a damn good team right there. So we're going to try a couple more. Okay, let's see how we do up against this team. I don't know. Okay, 20,000. Let's give her 30,000. That'll work. Okay, so let's see. Oh, well, I wasn't trying to do that, but oh well. Well, see, okay. Okay, let's see here. Maybe we'll have better luck with the raids. We might. Maybe. We'll see. That's why I didn't only want to rely on only friendly duels for this. Because of something like this, right? So she's got 14,000. Okay. I am going to take him out just because keeping Kenny alive would have been a bigger mistake, honestly. So we got 4,000 trauma. Well, it might be more than that. Let's see. This is a situation I like. Let's see. Is it 10,000? I thought it was four. He must have. Yeah, the 6,000. So yeah, that's correct. Okay, 16,000 trauma. That was a little bit of a better test than the first team. Okay, now we're going to do one more. One more for friendly duels. And then we'll move on to raids. But let's see if we can take down Lydia. Okay. I didn't want her hanging around. So that should give him 10,000. Okay, I mean, excuse me, Lao Po is not a him. So, how much trauma... Okay, she's got, what, 20... Is it 20,000 trauma? I'm trying to see. Got so many uh, bubbles. I'm not really sure. It, he doesn't look... I mean, she doesn't look like she's got any. I don't know why I'm mixing up Lao Po's... I don't know why I'm mixing it up. Why I'm thinking Lao Po's a dude. <laughs> and she's clearly not. Okay, so he's back. Okay, so that gives Lao Po 4,000 trauma. Alright. Oh my goodness. That infection must have done the job. Yeah. Okay. I mean, the trauma's kind of working. I mean, well, that's the end of that. We might have better luck in raids. Not gonna lie. We might. So, that's the end of friendly duels. And, you know what? I have kind of been testing this team out a little bit. 
and it's worked okay honestly okay so let's see Darius has 6,000 let's give him 10,000 don't hit Darius ah uh, well okay too late okay let's see if we can just make Ezekiel and Wanderer the stars the stars of these raids so that should give them 20,000 trauma yeah I, I do believe so where do they where are they getting that trauma from one of them uh oh Mateo okay Well, that'll work. The trauma did officially take him out, so. <laughs> oh no, Beta's got decap, doesn't he? Oh man. Alright. Okay. Okay, Ezekiel's got 13,000 trauma. So that should give him... Okay, no. He's got only 10,000. Would I get this weapon? Only if you really, really, really want it. Otherwise, I don't think it's worth it. I really wanted the weapon and the character. That's why I spent what I spent. Now, will I continue to boycott the battle passes after this? More than likely. More than likely. And, I mean, I was missing out on thousands of Javelin Hids already. Free to play. Okay, this is a too easy of a test so let's just yeah that that was way too easy we'll probably do a couple more raids I don't know I should have known that they only had to one tune based off who they picked as the leader How many javelin hits do I have right now? I want to say like 80 some thousand. I mean, you need 200,000 javelin hits to get all five copies. So, this might be a better. We might have a better success rate with the trauma on this team. I mean, against this team, maybe. Mr. Lou, he's got like over, okay, almost 31,000 trauma. Let's give him four more. Did that take care of? Ooh, look at that. That's a pretty good, that's pretty good. I really like that. I really like this Ezekiel tune. Sure, the uh, test started off a little rocky. Not gonna, you know, I'm gonna admit that, but... As we went along, it's gotten a little bit better. I really like the tune. That's why I shelled out the money. Because I knew I wasn't going to be able to get him free to play. Because I've already missed out on thousands of the roadmaps. Thanks. I mean, not roadmaps, but the javelin hits. But that was because of those... Uh, Pacific roadmaps where I had to have a certain tune that I don't have. Wow. Okay, infection all around. Great. Great. We're probably going to have to finish this without our stars. That's great. But.
wonderful. <laughs> this is an L. Like, yeah. Okay. Yeah, what's Jackie gonna do against Noor? Like, let's be honest. I mean, it was kind of working there for a minute, but I'm just mainly doing this for fun. And just to show you this team that I might feature on raids, maybe, maybe not, or a variation of this team, I don't know. But let's not screw around with Ghost, nor Brutus, like... The only reason, like I said, that I spent the money on this tune is because I really wanted him. If I didn't want him that bad, I wouldn't have... Literally the only reason, like I've said like a couple times... And I don't know how my faction will do in regular CRW. I... Honestly, I don't know. The last Blitz War was pretty dreadful. It was pretty bad. Like, I barely managed to get 50,000 points. Barely. Okay. So, Martinez should go down. Okay, there we go. He's got 17,000 trauma. Let's see if that does him in. It does. Okay. Alright, I think we'll do one more. I done more raids than I said I was going to do. But I've kind of been getting into this as I'm recording this. So if it's not too long of a wait, we'll do one more. Alright, we'll do one more. Win or lose. Uh, uh. Yeah, I was gonna say Peacekeeper is a worry, but uh, but Sebastian Milton is also another worry because he can one-shot you. Just like that. Yeah, exactly my point about Sebastian. <laughs> He's a prick, man. Every which way you go, Sebastian Milton is a prick. And he definitely gets what he deserves. I'm just going to say that.
Please don't hit Peacekeeper, but you probably will. Okay. Who's got trauma? I don't know. But let's give you trauma to start with. I know 4,000 isn't really going to do a whole lot, but it's a start. What's that? 4,000 trauma? I think. I don't know. Let, let's move on. Whatever happens is what happens. Does Nor have trauma? I think so. Uh... Damn, she does. She sure does. Oh, really? Come on now. You know what? That'll work. <laughs> hey, that'll work. I don't know if we'll win, but we can certainly try. Let's see if we can finish her off with trauma, bleed, all that good stuff. Okay, that'll work. So, yeah, I, I just mainly did this video to show you a new team I might be using in raids, just to mix it up. And then also, I kind of did this video sort of for fun. So, yeah, that's going to do it for this one. That's all I got for you guys for today. I want to thank each and every one of you for stopping by and for your continued support. Or, if you're new, welcome in for the first time. All of you are very awesome, and I thank you again. And don't forget to hit the bell and switch on all notifications so you know the second I upload to YouTube. I am Buckbeak, and I'm going to go fly away back to my nest. Until next time, bye guys.